Assalamu alaikum rahmatullah and welcome to another Quran translation lesson where we um, look at the split word translation of the Holy Quran both in English and in Urdu. Um, today we'll be looking at the verses 83 to 85 um, but just before that um, let's try to understand the verses a, li a little bit. So in the first verse 82 um, according to Islam salvation can be attained only by combining true faith with good action. So in this verse, they talk about how to attain um, true salvation. And, and the Quran says that you must have true faith matched with good actions. Only then can you fully achieve that, that full contentment, that full um, salvation, which we are all searching for. The condition as to true faith serves as a warning to those people who reject certain prophets of God and still hope to attain salvation because they belong to a specified class and a, a specified class and are descended from certain holy persons and the condition of good actions serves as a warning to those who are negligent in deeds thinking that more enrollment in the category of believers will bring salvation islam would have none of them so again we must follow islam to the best and to the letter and match what we know with our faith um, with good actions, only then will we really do um, fulfill our rights to Allah and fulfill our rights to mankind as well. There's this, there's one word which is khalidun, um, which means um, abiding for a long time, um, but not necessarily for eternity. Um, as will be noted, the word has been used in verse 82 and 83, both with regard to the inmates of hell and of heaven. This should not give a rise to the misunderstanding either that both the punishment of hell and the reward of heaven are eternal or that both will come to an end after a long time the quran makes it clear elsewhere that though both the punishment of hell and the reward of heaven are meant to long are meant to last long it is only the reward of heaven which is everlasting and this can be found in chapter 11 verses 107 to 109 so the main point here hell is not forever. Everyone will eventually leave hell and go um, into heaven. Um, and the last verse, which talks about um, a covenant, um, and this verse does not refer to any particular covenant, but to a general covenant in joining the Jews to give up the vices which were rife among them at that time and to lead a virtuous life. The reference may be to the covenant between the Holy Prophet وسلم, and the Jews of Medina by which both sides undertook to help each other against a common enemy, and all disputes were to be referred to the Holy Prophet وسلم, for um, decision. So these are the three verses which we are going to look at today, and we've understood um, what the context of them is. Um, now we'll go um, and read the recitation of the verses to give glory to, to the verses, and then we'll split each of the words up and try to understand them in English and Urdu. And then at the end, we'll go through the hard words, um, just so that we have a list in front of us so that we can learn from that list. A'udhu billahi minash shaytani rajeem, bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Walladheena amanu wa amilu salihati ulaika ashabul jannati hum fiha khalidun. وَإِذْ أَخَذْنَا مِيثَاقَ بَنِي إِسْرَائِيلَ لَا تَعْبُدُونَ إِلَّا اللَّهِ وَبِالْوَالِدَيْنِ إِحْسَانًا وَذِي الْقُرْبَى وَالْيَتَامَى وَالْمَسَاكِينِ وَقُولُوا لِلنَّاسِ حُسْنًا وَأَقِيمُوا الصَّلَاةَ وَآتُوا الزَّكَاةَ ثُمَّ تَوَلَّيْتُمْ إِلَّا قَلِيلًا مِنْكُمْ وَأَنْتُمْ مُعْرِضُونَ وَإِذْ أَخَذْنَا مِيثَاقَكُمْ لَا تَسْفِقُونَ دِمَاءَكُمْ وَلَا تُخْرِجُونَ أَنفُسَكُمْ مِنْ دِيَارِكُمْ وَلَا تُخْرِجُونَ أَنفُسَكُمْ مِنْ دِيَارِكُمْ ثُمَّ أَقْرَرْتُمْ وَأَنْتُمْ تَشْهَدُونَ Now we'll look into the split word translation of these words. وَالَّذِينَ And they who آمَنُوا They believed وَعَمِلُوا الصَّالِحَاتِ And they did good works 
Ulaika ashabul jannati. Ulaika those ashabul jannati, dwellers al jannati, the heaven. Those are the dwellers of heaven. Hum fiha khalidun. In it they shall abide. Wa'id akhadna, and when we took Mithaka, a covenant, Bani Israila, from the children of Israel, La, not, Ta'buduna illallah, you shall not worship illa except but Allah, Allah, you shall not worship except Allah. Wa bil walidaini and bil walidaini with parents, ihsan and kindness. Wa dil qurba and kindred. Wa yatama and the orphans. Wa masakin and the poor. Wa qulu lin nasi. Wa and qulu you speak lin nasi for the people. Husnan kindly, and you should speak kindly to the people. وَأَقِيمُ الصَّلَاةَ And you observe the prayer. وَآتُ الزَّكَاةَ And pay the zakat. ثُمَّ Then تَوَلَّيْتُمْ You turned away. إِلَّا Except قَلِيلًا A few. مِنْكُمْ From you. وَأَنْتُمْ And you مُعْرِذُون Those who turned away. وَإِذْ And when أَخَذْنَا مِيثَاقَ وَإِذْ and when أَخَذْنَا we took مِيثَاكَكُمْ a covenant from you لَا تَسْفِكُونَ you shall not shed دِمَاءَكُمْ blood your blood وَلَا and not تُخْرِجُونَ you shall not turn out أَنفُسَكُمْ yourself مِنْ دِيَارِكُمْ from your homes ثُمَّ then أَقْرَرْتُمْ you confirmed wa antum and you tashhadun witness you all witness another urdu tajma of this walladhina amanu urjo log iman laaye wa amilu salihati aur unhone ki nekiya ulaika ye log ashabul jannati jannat wale hain Hum fiha khalidun. Hum wo fiha isme khalidun. Reh parne wale hai. Wa id akhadna or jab diya hamne. Mitha ka bani israila. Pakka wada bani israil se. La ke na ta boduna ibadet karinge illallah. Suwai Allah ke Wa bil walidaini Or ma baap se Ihsanan Ihsan karoge Wa dil kurba Or rishta daro Wal yatama Or yatimo Wal masakini Or miskino sibi Wa kulu Or kaho Lin nasi Lokon ko Husnan Achi baat Wa akimu salata اور قائم کرو نماز و آت و زکاة اور دو زکاة ثم پھر توزلیتم پھر گئیتم الا مگر قلیلا تھوڑے منکم تم میں سے و اور انتم تم مؤردون اراز کرنے والے تھے و اور اذ جب اخذنا ہم نے لیا میتاککم پکا وعدہ تم سے لا نا تسفکونا نا بہاو نا بہاو گے دماءکم خون اپنے ولا اور نا تخرجونا نکالو گے انفسکم اپنے لوگوں کو من دیارکم گھروں سے اپنے ثُمَّ پھر اقررتم اقرار کیا تم نے وَأَنْتُمْ اور تم تشہدون تم دیکھتے ہو تم گوائی کرتے ہو
أنتم مؤرضون تم إراز كرني والدي وإذا خذنا ميثاككم أرجب لي همني بك والدتم سي لا تسفكون نا بهوغي دماءكم خون أبني ولا تخرجون ورنا نكالوغي أنفسكم أبني لوغونكو من دياركم غرو سي أبني ثم فر أكررتم إكرار كيا تمني وأنتم تشهدون أرتم قواهو Now just some of the hard words which we went over from um, today. Um, so if you look at um, from the middle side, تعبدون تم إبادة كروجي You will worship. Walidain means um, two parents. So your mother and your father. So walid uh, or walidain meaning two. Ihsanan to show kindness. Um, the means wala, uh, also dhu or the are both the same meaning. Um, just to expound on this word, this word is used in connection with a compliment. Its proper rendering depends upon the sense of the words in connection with which they occur. Their most usually rendering is possessor of, lord of, endowed with, having with, on, in, of, owner. Um, Kurba, kurbat, kindred. Uh, blood relations, yatama, orphans, yatim, masakin, gharib, log, the poor, husnan, kindness, achibat, tawalaytum, you turned away, and ma'aridun, miraz karnewale, those who avert, those who um, turn away. So these um, were some of the just the end of the lesson, Jazakumullah for watching us and so um, I hope and pray everyone is doing well and everyone is um, coping in this time of COVID-19. May Allah make everything easy for you and help us to continue learning and continue um, expanding on our on our spirituality and on our knowledge. Jazakumullah for watching. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.